Has oh crap! I didn't plug in the mic. Now it's better. Okay, how do we start this? Okay, so I've been feeling quite drained out by life in general. So I took like a four day. I, I took a week off from work, but which was actually four days because Monday I actually did still go back to work to just focus on doing my own stuff. And so the first day. I did nothing at all because I planned so many things that I wanted to accomplish and I, I just froze. I, I didn't even enjoy the day by playing games, I just froze. I did nothing at all. And so the second day got slightly better and then third day was when I finally started filming stuff and editing stuff so it's like I wasted two days away. It, it just be like that sometimes. We'll get into burnout and the pie chart of time and life and stuff in another video which I, I do want to talk about but for now to keep this momentum going that I will upload and I will edit this is an old vlog that I filmed early this year uh, for one of the Instagram campaigns so once in a while I get Instagram jobs where a client pays me money to promote a service or a product or whatever and I usually like to really enjoy that process whether it's to go out and shoot something creative or do something crazy with it so this one was for grab so grab basically had this campaign where you could go plant virtual seeds somewhere and depending on how hidden that location is you would get a certain amount of grab points by the way this video is not sponsored whatsoever it's just a recap vlog but anyways i wanted to go to clementi forest because i've never been there i thought it was going to be easy and so i embarked on it with a picture in mind which i wanted to shoot and this is what happened so no no fancy transitions this time i'm just I'm, it's late okay you can see the light outside it's late let me just upload this video i will do something better for the next video or the one after next or something okay it will get better let me get into things the video i freaking forgot to bring my camera while it's going out but uh yeah i'm here i'm at like near maju camp i actually see a bunch of people going up from like the back side so i think i'm gonna revisit that because this is the clemency tunnel in front of me so i'm gonna check it out first before i head into the forest then. we're going we're going old school style vlogs man back to the phone Man, I didn't, I didn't even bring along a tripod. Real old school. So this is Clemente Tunnel. We got a few people like taking pictures, I think. So the difficulty here is it's 11, gosh, what time is it? 11.40, I need to be at work at two. So I'm on a very tight timeline here to take this photo. I'm up for the challenge. I'm speed running through this forest right now. Hello, butterfly. Okay. So I see some paths, but I'm not sure if this so, leads me the right way. If you're ever stuck in a jungle, find the paths which are like the most easy to walk. Usually following those or following along rivers is going to get you somewhere. Now a little bit in and my shoes are already gone, man. The double path. This is where we can look at the map, huh? tree looks nice though. On the map it shows this stream of water, this very short stream of water. I think that's where most people get their like nice shots. I'm gonna try to head this way and hit that water path. Hopefully it's the right place. Another kind of like um, two-way path but this one doesn't really lead to like at least to that light area but that's like a dead end. So that looks tough. I'm gonna continue here and maybe walk through that side. I don't, I don't know. I actually see some like worker developers here in front of me. Okay, we've hit our first kind of like dead zone. Here's like, I see the water stream here. But that's not the water stream I thought it was. So I think I need to try to head up that way. That's dead end. This kind of has like a path. That's like the drainage system, so. I'm not gonna lie, I feel very lost right here. Kind of walked out towards the roadside again. And it's all tall grass behind me, but I found a stream. So I think I'm gonna just follow the stream. Only sucky thing is I'm, I might get wet. I'm, try, I'm gonna try to jump to the other side, I think. And then we'll, we'll go from there. Man, this is way more of an adventure than I thought it would be. I thought it was just easy, like getting in, take the picture, get out. Man, this is turned into a full adventure. Holy shit. Oh, got it. This might actually be the street. Whoa, shit. This might be the stream I was talking about, so I'm gonna try to follow it. I see some coverage in front. I gotta be 
really careful with my steps here. And this path is definitely not well walked. And then I have no idea how to get through. So let's try new ways. There's another stream. But whether this leads into the canopy area, I don't know. So there's like a straight path down there, which I want to head to. But uh, not too sure how to get to there. I feel better because I actually see a path. But if you see here, there's a spider web here. I don't really want to with the spider web, but I, I don't think there's any other way through. So we're gonna just try to break it. It's gonna have to do. Let's hope this actually leads somewhere. Good. Oh shit. I walked through, but again, we've hit huge vegetation. I'm creating a whole new path. I can confidently say I am utterly lost. I have no idea. We're just gonna find paths. Alright, I somehow bashed my way out of that. And I found myself this. Open area, always good. Slight sign of uh, humanity. We've got like a small tentage here. We've got like chairs over there. I mean, if this is at night, obviously this is scary as shit, but in the day, I think we're good. And we're back on path. So we got three paths to choose from. We got that one, this middle one. Wait, let me try to point it so the camera see this one. And this one, which leads this one looks really sketchy, this one, so now, I think I'll try to take this middle path, this looks the safest, if not we just walk back. So. Okay, now I'm, I'm starting to regret my decision, you know what, I might realign myself to the, to the right path, let's, let's do that instead. I basically went the opposite direction from uh, the direction we were heading. I don't see any open area, so I don't think that's the way, so I'm gonna continue backtracking. I wonder whether like... I head the wrong direction from the start to begin with and that's why I keep heading into like more forest rather than like open area and the area that I'm looking for but uh yeah so I'm honestly looking at this path down right now so that's trees down because I see a bit of a stream there I don't know whether I should follow the stream but this this down slope is crazy though and if I go down there's no there's no turning back and it's like 12.10, so I've got another like 20 minutes max before I just like try to head for the roads and just try to go back. I think I'm gonna take the risk here and just go downwards. Although it's it's a bash down, man. It's a bash down. Go down and then head there and try to head right. <sighs> Made it to the water. That was a challenge in itself. Sorry. I kind of want to go to the other side, but this is no jump I can make. It's very difficult to keep heading down, but I do see a slight path there. I'm gonna have a quick look at the map, try to figure this out which way, whether I should just like step into the water and like go across. I also don't know how deep this water is, but GPS is, is acting up, so I, I'm not sure. I'm just gonna keep walking along the water bank. I think this heads along the roadside to one of the open areas. But we're gonna try, we're just gonna try to speed run this because 15 minutes and I gotta bail out. Clock is 12.32 But We found something We found an open area oh. The weirdest thing is I have a feeling There's the easiest way to get in But I made it out of the jungle Made it I was this close To giving up Because I saw the clock It was 12.30 And I was like Shit, should I turn around? Look at the map I'm pretty close to the thing, which I think is the thing. And here it is. This is that shot which everyone gets when they come here. There is, I'm pretty sure if I walk down this path, this is an easy way to get in. But I just, I just walk loops and loops around and call it bad luck or just call it bad navigation. But we're here. We're not gonna bash in more because I'm freaking exhausted and I'm gonna do my campaign, so. Yeah, basically there's a grab thing and then you can plant a seed somewhere. Time check, 12.40. We've got a little bit of time left to escape this place, which I think is just a straight road down which we'd hit the road. Planted a seed, the top price you can get is like 10,000 points and they're estimating my seed to be 2,000. I went through all this trouble for 2,000 grab points. Oh my god. Oh, freaking, I don't know. Uh, I want to say I want to kill myself, but there's a sensitive topic right now, so I still said it. Mm. I'm left with an hour and 20 minutes to head back to the office. There's a shower there, so I'm going to shower. i got to pack lunch and then change and everything and then 
yeah i didn't expect myself to vlog today but suddenly just felt like whipping out a camera and this felt good this felt good this is like the old vlog days man where it's just a random adventure something simple turned into something epic this was fun let me okay let me walk down and if there's an easier way to get here let me tell you guys how to get and i believe if you guys just continue walking down this path there's like more adventure there so you don't have to take the same thing i did i just went a full ns adventure once again for no reason so okay let's just head up Oh shit, oh. water, water, lots of water. Yeah, maybe getting in here wasn't as easy as I thought. That's the road. That's not a straight path in. Shit, had to, had to walk all the way, I don't know, like loop around or something. I could try to get there, actually. Like, they're on the right side to climb up. Let's try to do that, but it's gonna be wet down below. I found my way out, but I tried to cross the river and I went straight into the mud, like knee, knee high. This is actually here even. That's how much and my shoes are soaked and it, and it stinks. It, it definitely stinks. I, I'm gonna like to try to deal with this. Not this bad. I didn't come prepared for this bad. It's not even swamp water. It's, it's sewage. What? Okay, not really sewage, but it came out from the long goals, from the uh, drainage system. Honestly, I totally forgot the English term for long go. I kind of remember that I have extra shirts in the office as well, so I'm just going to change into this first. But uh, you can see, like, we're actually quite close to the road, which is probably one of the reasons why the grab seats didn't do so well. So I've screenshotted where exactly this entrance is. So if you guys just want to take that shot real quick, there's an easy way, which is like this, um, this bus stop here. You can align it with the map and then you guys can just walk, walk along like the side path or something. It does get a bit like slippery but walking along the side is pretty safe. A little bit muddy but that's pretty safe. Just don't walk along the middle. The middle just sinks in all of a sudden which is what happened to me and I'm like drenched. Funny thing is, I still ended up slightly late at work. I ended up still gaining a lot of points from this whole campaign, but um, that was just a funny story. And if you made it this far in the video, I just want to say all those who stayed around, I appreciate you guys so much. Um, I'm not seeing like the views that I had before, and I feel great about it because I feel no pressure at all, and I can just upload, and I, I don't care about views. I just want to get back into the momentum and I think that's most important for me right now rather than caring about like, oh, at least getting like 5k or 10k views or whatever. Like, it doesn't matter if I get 200 views. The fact that 200 people are watching and I see the comments motivating me, people still, who appreciate and miss my content, I think that means the world to me and I hope this content is fun for you guys to watch. So if you guys want whatever, can comment it down below okay anyways once again very grateful for everyone okay take it easy crew i hope you guys enjoyed this vlog i'll see you guys in the next one 